How's everyone doing today? It's Nikki here. We are Sunday, the 14th or 15th or somewhere around there. And you know what? I have had a little bit of a mental break crisis thing going on the past couple weeks, couple days, couple months really. And you know what? That's okay. It really is. It's okay. But I do need to start putting my mental health before first. So what we're going to start doing is trying to get somewhat on routine, and I say this all the time and I feel like I sound like a broken record player when I'm saying this, but it's a thing we're going to try to do. And I'm actually going to write out a routine. So that's what we're going to be doing today. I have my book of life where I'm going to start keeping track of everything, and I have tried to start keeping track of some things. Not very much actually, now that I'm looking at it. But that's okay, because you know what? It's a start, and it's a start in the right direction. So I think I'm gonna be planning a morning routine for every morning, and then a evening routine for every evening, and then just like the kind of things that I'm gonna do every day in between. Cause I do need to start taking better care of myself, and one of the easiest ways to kind of do that would probably be to start doing things regularly and in a certain order, just to make it more normalized taking care of myself because I really don't take care of myself and I know I need to so I'm going to start a list of things that I need to do first thing when I wake up every day and then before I go to bed every day just to kind of like better take care of myself and better have a handle on life and hopefully that will kind of like tidy up the rest from there and we'll move from having a routine to having my life kind of semi in order to keeping my I don't know. And we'll move from having a routine to having my life semi in order to just everything else on the go. And I feel like as the more I get my life in order, the more everything else will just kind of start falling into place. And the first thing, as I have stated, that we're gonna be doing for me getting my life in order is trying to figure out what the I need to do in the morning to take care of myself. Because I haven't taken care of myself. I don't take care of myself. I lay in bed all day and then I roll out of bed before work and slowly start getting ready for work over two hours. So, like, there's really no excuse to not get up in the morning and do everything that I have to do in the morning. And a part, that's part of it too. When I'm saying morning, I think part of it mean, for me has become, I feel I have to become like an eight o'clock, seven o'clock, six o'clock morning person. And that's not me, I'm a night owl. And I've embraced that for years. And the past couple of months, I've been fighting that, trying to become a morning person. So morning for me is anywhere between like nine to 10, we're gonna say. Nine, we're gonna get up around like nine to 10. That's when I'm gonna get up in the morning. So morning routine. I'm gonna get up around nine to 10. I'm gonna brush my teeth. I'm gonna have a shower. Cause I feel like I'm not, a, I'm not really a morning shower. I don't even know if I'm a morning shower or an evening shower really. Some days I shower in the morning, some days I shower at night. It all depends on the day and how time goes, but I'm going to try to start showering in the morning every day so that it just kind of starts the day right, because I can, no, I don't know if I want to do a cold shower though, but a warm shower is just going to make me want to curl up and go back to bed. So now we're going to have a quick cold shower in the morning and that's going to kind of wake us up. And then we're going to brush our teeth, brush our hair, do our makeup, straighten our hair. And I don't think I'm gonna put like major things up in my makeup routine. I think I'm gonna keep it back to the basics. Cause like, I used to just kind of throw on some foundation, throw on some lips, throw on some mascara, throw on some brows. And for me going over the top was, okay, I'm gonna line my eyes. And then I threw in all this contour and all this eyeshadow and it's just kind of getting overwhelmed, especially considering I can't even take care of myself. So back to the baby steps. Cause life just got overwhelming. So we're gonna build back from the basics. What am I in f***ing kindergarten? Fuck. So get up nine to 10, brush teeth, shower, brush hair, do makeup, shave while I'm in the shower. Straighten hair. Cause I wanna start wearing my hair down again more cause that's something that I miss. I really do miss it. I don't know. 
feel like there's, I want to start cooking food, so I'm going to make something every day. And I don't think I'm going to try to make anything exaggerant, exact, exuberant, exuberant, but something just kind of like quick and easy. So like, maybe like scrambled eggs or something like that. Because that's something I can just get up, go downstairs, turn on the pan, go up for a smoke, brew coffee before I go up for a smoke. Actually, there we go. Okay. So I'm going to go, after I finish getting all ready and dressed and doing my hair and my makeup and all that stuff, I'm going to go downstairs, brew coffee, heat pan, go for smoke, come back inside, drink coffee as I cook eggs. And then I'm going to cook some eggs. And then I'll have breakfast, and I'll have my coffee, and I'll be all dressed, and I'll be all ready, and everything will all be good. And this will bring me to like, if I'm getting up at nine, this will probably be like 11 o'clock at this point in time. If I'm getting up at 10, it'll probably be like 12 o'clock at this point in time, because I think I can get ready in two hours. So after that, I'll sit there and do any editing that I have to do from the previous day. And that'll take me to whenever I have to go to work. And then I'll go to work. I'll work. I'll come home. And let's see. Do I want to do an evening routine right when I get home from work? Or do I want to make something that I do before I go to bed? If I make it right when I get home from work, then I can do my evening routine and then just lounge around for the rest of the evening. So my evening routine is going to consist of coming home from work, First thing I'm gonna do is sesh, obviously. Then after that, I'll go do some yoga. Maybe, potentially, we'll try. We'll see if we can. I need to start doing yoga again. I really do mess up. I, I enjoyed yoga a lot in high school. So we're gonna try to get that back into the routine. So sesh, yoga, dance. And I'm gonna do that as my daily kind of workout. So that's going to keep me energized and working out. So that's going to be good there. And then shower afterwards. And this will be like my warm shower where I'm like, oh, this is so beautiful and bliss. Or maybe I'll make it a bath. Who knows? So yes, I'll be taking two showers in the day. But I feel like that might help because I'll have a cold shower in the morning to help wake me up and get me going. And then a nice warm shower at the end of the day to help me relax and go to sleep. And then again... I guess I'll remove my makeup in the shower, I'll brush my teeth, I don't know what I'll do with my hair. I'll try not, I'll probably, I probably won't wash my hair because I don't want to have to straighten my hair all the time, but we'll also just kind of play it by ear and see how that goes, so who knows. So brush my teeth, do whatever I'm doing with my hair, and then Netflix. Is that really all I have for an evening routine? I mean supper at some point in time. Excuse me, sorry. Supper at some point in time. Oh, there's a cab here. I don't think it's for me though, but I did order Skip the Dishes, I say as I'm trying to get on routine. Yes, I ordered Skip the Dishes. I got Buffet Express and I got the special for three and I'm gonna have Chinese food for three or four days again because I don't wanna cook. But I am gonna do breakfast. It's just gonna be my supper. So I'm gonna still do like the egg stuff for breakfast, but like, I don't want to cook in the evening right now. I'm going to take a vegetating day and as I slowly start getting into this, then we'll add cooking to the mix. Cause cooking is a lot. It's a lot of friggin' work to live and take care of yourself. But I was with my stepmom today and we went to go get coffee and then hang out because my stepmom's down visiting. And I can't just be happy. Like you don't just be happy. You have to put effort into being happy and taking care of yourself and doing things you enjoy. and just being happy. So like, I'm not gonna just roll out of bed and be like, oh, I'm happy all of a sudden. No, if I wanna be happy, I'm gonna have to work for it and take care of myself. And I've said this before, but no one's gonna want me if I'm a mess. Realistically, let's be real. No one's gonna want someone who doesn't have their together. So I need to get my together. My belly hurts. I'm hungry, that's what it is. Where's my fucking food? I want Chinese food, rawr. Give me food. It'll feed me for days. Where are you? But yeah, back on track. I don't really know what I need for an evening routine. I really don't. Sesh, yoga, 
dance, shower, brush my teeth, do my hair, curl up, watch the Netflix, sesh some more. I don't know. Have a guy over. At some point in time throughout the day, I record the video for the day. But that's, I don't know, like this routine seems like so basic and so like doesn't really consist of stuff. And I feel like it's missing a shit ton of stuff, but I just don't know. And I guess a lot of these stuff are pretty basic too. Like I'm gonna shower. Well, shower is a very broad topic. There's a lot of stuff that happens in the shower. I'm gonna do my hair, I'm gonna do my makeup. Well, that's gonna take a decent amount of time. I'm gonna cook. There is actually a lot of stuff on here, I guess. I don't know. But I think it's gonna be good to try to have a routine every morning for the morning. I don't mean like a routine for scheduling for this because I'm still not sure where this all kind of falls. I thought I wanted to do every, I don't, I'm still not sure where all the scheduling for YouTube kind of falls, but I do need a morning routine and I do need an evening routine. And I also need my Chinese food. So with that, I'm gonna be ending it here. Hopefully you've enjoyed today's video. If you have, be sure to drop a like, hit that subscribe button down below and wanna comment something to make it a triple threat because you know, who doesn't like a triple threat? My triple threat for the day is I now have a morning routine, I now have an evening routine, and I still have free time in the middle of the day. I was gonna say Chinese food and use that as a triple threat, but that doesn't really play into it. So morning routine is all scheduled, evening routine is all scheduled, and then middle of the day, in between like after morning routine and then before work and then after work and before evening routine, I have free time. And I have free time after my evening routine because my evening routine is I think it's the evening routine that I'm not happy with, but I really don't know what to put in an evening routine. Excuse me, sorry. I think it's the evening routine that I'm not happy with, but I really don't know what to put in an evening routine. So maybe I'll check out some people's evening routines and see what other people do to take care of themselves at the end of the night, because at the end of the day, I just want to curl up in bed and smoke some weed. At the end of the day, I just want to curl up in bed, get stoned and watch Netflix or edit or whatever I have going on. I mean, if I still have recording or editing to do, then I'll do that. But once all that's done, I just want to curl up and watch some Netflix and maybe have someone over to come cuddle. Yeah, but I don't know. I need to get on routine. I know that. I need to take better care of myself. Hopefully that is going to help. But I also, like, no, I can't go into it with the mindset that it's going to fail. Because if I go into the mindset with it's going to fail, Tomorrow I'm just gonna wake up and then go back to bed. I have to go in with the mindset like, no, I'm going to stick to this routine and I'm actually gonna start taking care of myself. But like, I'm probably gonna get my Chinese food and curl up and go to bed and watch some Netflix, let's be real. I don't know, we'll see. That would actually be beautiful and bliss and amazing. The only way that that would be better if I had a guy to eat Chinese food in bed and watch Netflix with right now, that would be bliss. I don't know, maybe I'll ask around and see if anyone wants to come over. Be like, hey, I bought Chinese food, wanna come get fat with me? All right, no. So yeah, I guess with that, I'm gonna be ending it here and I'll see you whenever I upload today's video.